it's Joe again from Innovative Electronics US. I'm out here today at Avalanche again. So here we've got the LH, the T1000, and the Max 1500 watt. You can see these things are pretty moddable. Traction pad, cush pad, sidekicks, flight fins. Also, this is grip tape here. Grip tape. Accessories can be made to fit with very small modifications. So I'm gonna take these boys out for a ride today. I don't always wear pads and helmets when I'm out riding, but when I do, this is what I throw on. Full motocross armor, spine protector, shoulder protection, elbow, forearm. They're, it's super comfortable to wear, super light, and I feel incredibly safe. I've wiped out a few times wearing this, and it saved my shoulder. I, I know I would have hurt myself. So we're going to take the LH out first for its first run. Top speed, 13 miles an hour, but we'll see how it all goes. So I'm not going to lie. I really thought that with the T1000 and 1500, I wasn't going to like riding my LH anymore. But if I'm being perfectly honest, like this thing is still so fun and flowy and I'd hit 15 miles an hour on that last trail run. So the difference between this and the original Trotter is that this has an upgraded battery in it. It's the LH model. So it's got a 10.5 amp hour battery inside of it. So basically if you can imagine what the CBXR does to the XR in terms of performance, that's what this model is compared to the original Trotter. Okay, so next I'm gonna take out the T1000 here. It's got a cush pad on it and traction pad on the front, sidekicks, handle, and uh, 1000 watts of power. So top speed is 17. We're gonna see what I can hit. So that was definitely a fun lap. It's a little bit faster than the LH. Uh, this thing handles great. Uh, it just takes a little bit more, you have to pay a little bit more attention to what you're telling it to do. But uh, 17 miles an hour on that lap, and it's pretty solid ride, man. Now it's time to take the big boy out. See what kind of time I can hit today on this lap. All right, so going from the LH to the T1000, then to this 1500. <laughs> I forgot almost. Man, this thing just got so much power, cooking right up hills. And I had a pretty good average mile per hour, 9.6, almost 10 miles an hour average. and hit 18 miles an hour on that run. And this thing is intense. All right, so I'm going to go on a nice cruise on Sidewinder and take the Vimble with me this time for the 1500 and see what kind of ride footage I can get. So, like, this hill is actually pretty steep. I don't know how hard, how much you can tell. This rut walks right up it. damn bimble already. Got the Strava app running in the background. I don't know if you can tell how steep this hill is.
like nailed this time. Yeah. So